Hello everyone, this is Noble H. Mushtaq, and welcome to the main association of Math League's website. This is... I've done a few videos of problems from this competition, so I just want to explain what this is. It's a main... Main is a state in the United States of America. So it's a main wide competition. And you have to be someone in Maine, in a school that participates in this competition, to be able to compete. But basically, there are... Let's get the problems up. Okay. So, basically, you have five meets. Okay. So, as you can see here, you have one, two, three, four, five meets throughout the year. And in each meet, there's five individual rounds and one team round. So, these are from all of the individual rounds. Each individual round has a topic. And, actually, I think they have the topics on the website. They, no. Okay. So, yeah, these are all of the topics. So, you have the first topic in around the second topic, the third topic, the fourth topic, the fifth topic, and then the team topic. The team round is nine problems, each individual round is three problems, and the fifth and sixth round always allow calculators. The others don't. So. So, as you can see, these are the individual problems. You have three problems, one three-pointer problem, one four-pointer problem, and one five-pointer problem. And you have that for five rounds. So one round is worth 12 points. All five are worth 60 points. So if you get 60 points in a meet. That's a perfect score. As you can see, getting a perfect score is really hard. But some people do it. Like this person, he's first in the state and he did it. And there's another person who did it. And yeah. So if you're in like the top 10, you might get a perfect score. But it's really hard. And being in the top 10 is really hard. So yeah. Usually I think people get like... I think a 20 would be a good score for an average high school student. 20 is a pretty good score. 30 is a really good score. 40, 40, you'll get, you're really getting there. 50, you, you're, yeah. And then 60, that 60 is just really hard. Almost no one gets a 60. So yeah, the thing with this competition is that it leads up to a national. Oh, once after the five meets, each um school can pick. 12 students to go to the state meet. So there's also a state meet at the end for the whole state. And each meet happens at a high school in your area. So if you live in, like, Southburg, Elliot, it might happen in Southern Maine, like Noble High School or Kennebunk High School. And where I, that's where I live, so there's, like, different leagues. And I'm in the Pike Cone South League, and... So, th th I would compete with those schools, so. And they have rankings of people, so yeah. This is me, I, I got 11th this year, I was an 8th grader this year, so. Okay. So. Yeah, it's a fun competition, I just wanted to introduce you to it. And the thing about this competition is that it, it leads up to a national competition called OMOL, which happens at four places all around the country. And it already happened this year. So you might get picked if you're in the top 50, I think. But usually they pick the top 30 and then six alternates, but a lot of people aren't able to go, unfortunately. So they keep going down, and usually if you're in the top 50, or if you do really well and you miss a meet, like I missed a meet, I was 46th, and I got picked to go, except I wasn't able to go, unfortunately. So, yeah. So if you do really well, you're able to go to the national competition. I think if you to get into like 30th place, you have to have an average around... Uh, 42. Let's see. Yeah, so this this year, this post had an average of 42. I, I've only seen one year, so that's that's not really based off of anything. It's only based off of this year. And to get 50th place, you have to get, like, I average... Yeah, so that was my average. I was 46th. And that, that was an average of 37. So yeah, if you're getting high 30s, low 40s, you're doing pretty good, I think. If you're getting high 50s, obviously, you're... you're you probably already know what this competition is by then. And, yeah. So, it's a fun competition. It's probably easier than 
um, other popular math competitions that are nationwide, like um, American Mathematics Competition, like the AMC, as you might have heard of. It's definitely yeah, it's definitely easier than that, but th th that makes it better in my opinion because it's available to more people. So yeah. Uh, I hope this explained Mammal to you well. You again visit the site at mammal.net and have fun doing math. So, yeah.